Ladies and gentlemen, I am finishing up uh, putting together this document. You all, pay attention, are going to have to do the research and you're going to have to include a section that it's not the case citations that is most important. It is the principles aligning with the case citations. So what we're going to do is, because there have been some people out there who've been, you know, little vocal saying that I use chat GPT and the case citations when they look it up they're wrong I tell everybody to do their own homework and research I tell you guys that chat GPT lies I say that all the time as a matter of fact that's why I'm often correcting him when he gives information but there are those out there who want to make it like I'm relying on chat GPT no I'm relying on what I know uh oh I did something wrong. I can't do it that way. So let's, hey, got to wait for it. Um, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to find somebody out there who's been through more than I have and who's gone through the courts and did all the things that I have done. I'd like to find somebody else out there, but I promise you I have not. Uh, what What is the song? I've been around the world and I, 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 I. From Puerto Rico to Florida to Texas to Louisiana to New York to North Carolina to what, where else are we going to talk about? New Mexico, Arizona, California. Again, I've gone all over this country testing out their Pennsylvania, testing out their system. Uh, what is that other place? Uh, Wisconsin. I'm distracted right now, and so I keep making the same mistake because I'm distracted trying to think of these different states that I've been through. Look, ladies and gentlemen, each of these cases talk about passengers for hire. We're going to take at least eight of them. I'm going to control C. I kept doing control Z. Uh, control C is our friend. That's where we at. That's where we began. And we're going to go to perplexity. Perplexity is not ChatGPT. Well, technically it is ChatGPT, but protect, per, 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 perplexity, what happens when you use it? It does your top searches, top five, to say the least. And so I put these cases in there, and I, this case says, operating a vehicle for the purposes of transporting passengers for hire. I said transportating. A specific license requires a specific license emphasizing commercial nature of the activity. Now, let's see what perplexity has to say, because that's a lot of cases. The case in State versus Harris decided in Louisiana Supreme Court in 1935 is a significant ruling that it distinguishes between private personal use and commercial use of vehicles. The court held that transportation of passengers or goods or service for hire constitutes commercial use, which requires a specific license. This regulation is imposed to protect the public welfare by ensuring that commercial vehicle operators adhere to safety and regulation. Similarly, state versus city of New Orleans, New Orleans, the Louisiana Supreme Court reiterated that operating a vehicle for the purposes of transporting passengers for hire necessitates specific licenses. These rulings align with other decisions from various courts, such as the People versus blah, 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 which all emphasizes the requirement for a license when engaging in the business of transporting passengers for hire. The consistent terms across these cases is the legal distinction between private and commercial vehicle use which the latter being subject to licensing to ensure public safety compliance ladies and gentlemen i don't want to hear everybody else in their grandmama tell me what i know what i don't know or what i can and cannot do i already know this right here eventually they'll stop me again and i'll have to go through it but unlike most of you i drive Let's see, when I go to the city, that's over 160 miles round trip. And since I retrieved this vehicle back in, what, 
October. I put 8,000 miles on the vehicle. I've been stopped while in someone else's vehicle that wasn't registered, but that person was uh, suffering from white privilege, and so they didn't impound the vehicle. But the officer gave me a problem, asked me what my name was, and I told him, my name is Eon. I'm in the system. I know it. He knew it because, he, give me a moment. He goes back and he checks and he comes back and gives a comment to the driver. Doesn't speak to me again. Doesn't say another word to me. Speaks to the driver only. You need to tell your friend to watch his attitude. <laughs> Y'all know me. I was getting ready to let him know what an attitude really was because he was confused. And I didn't because it wasn't my automobile. If it was my automobile, I definitely would have given him a piece of my mind. Just because you wear a badge doesn't mean that you get to say whatever you want to me and I don't get to say it back. Equal protection of law, mother... I mean, Nick, I mean, uh, idiot. Equal protection of law. If you want to raise your voice to me, I will raise my voice to you. I love equal protection of law. It says I get to do what you get to do. Do unto one's neighbor as they want to have done unto them. Well, guess what? They want equal protection of law. They want them freedom. So they want me to give them exactly what they've given me. That's a, that's a miscarriage. You can't do that. You can't just sit up here and you're just twisting. And, and... Have a good day, everybody. We will speak again.